Today I'm doing a follow-up challenge for the pocket hose brass bullet. This was suggested to me by reader Thomas the Sailor Chubby, who said leave it in the sun all day under pressure and see what happens. I thought that was a good idea, so I'm going to test it out right now and see how the pocket hose brass bullet does in that test. Normally what I do is I attach it to my, my faucet here, I put it under pressure, maybe water some plants out there, and I take it back in. I'm going to use my metal garden hose as an extension and have the entire pocket hose out in the yard all day for about eight straight hours. It's supposed to be about 108 today. Okay, it is now under pressure, out in the sun. I'm just gonna leave it there. I'll check on it every hour or so, and see how it does. And Bailey's keeping an eye on it for me, right Bailey? Okay, I came out here to check on my... <laughs> Bailey's playing with her wobble wag giggle. Anyway, I came out here after one hour to check on the hose. And just so you know, it is 108 degrees out here, okay? The hose has been out in the heat, in the sun, not moving for one hour. And here we go. Oh no! Oh no! Here we go. Oh, this looks bad. All right, so we got we got a problem here. Look! Oh no! Oh! What is going on here? Oh, that's just, that's terrible. Oh, look at this. Look at that, oh no, oh no. Look how much is coming out of there. Oh, I gotta turn the water out. Pocket hose failed. It failed. Bailey, what, it failed, Bailey. Thought this would be the one. I thought it would be the one, but it is not the one. It's contracting right now because the water pressure's off, but the water all came out. Look, I don't know what exactly what happened, but, oh, here we go, look, oh, there's a, there's a break in it. Well, there it goes. Well, it lasted a little while, but as one brilliant commenter said, out in the heat doesn't do too well. Not, not good. I guess I'm a little bit surprised, but I'm not totally surprised based on the history of the pocket hose line, but oh man. I was hoping this would be the one that would last, but it didn't. Well, I can't just post this review. It'll be literally a minute long. So if this is all you came for, you can be excused, but I'm gonna see what else I can put out in the sun and how it affects those things because I don't wanna post a one minute review. So in our 108 degree weather with Bailey the dog out here, Bailey, how about if we serve a little lunch? And on today's menu, it's LP pizza. What happens when we take this Twisted Sister album, sorry D. Schneider, I just don't listen to this album anymore. What happens when D. Schneider says you can't stop rock and roll, but can the heat stop rock and roll? Let's see what happens. I'm gonna come out in another hour and see what D. Schneider and the boys look like after sitting out in 100 degree heat. Maybe it'll do better than the pocket hose brass bullet, which failed this test quite miserably. It didn't even last an hour. I don't even know how long it lasted. It was one hour from the time I put it out here, it's gone. So let's have a little fun. We're gonna put D. Schneider out here. I'm gonna check on this in about an hour and see how it looks. Maybe I can think of some other things to put out in the heat while I'm at it. Let's go see what's inside. Oh, it's literally been 15 minutes and it's already, it's already warping pretty badly. Ouch, ha, ah, that's hot. That was hot. I'll try it again. Ha, 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 Okay, so I'm gonna, I, I move this over here. And I have a new setup here with a bar of soap, a real candle, and a fake candle. And it's currently 109 degrees in the shade. Well, I tried doing a time lapse of the thing sitting out in the sun, but my camera overheated. But it's cooled off, it's fine now. So I'm gonna have to do it the old school where I just come check on it regularly. Here's what we got so far Twisted Sister. Nice. Look at that. Ah, oh, it's so cool. Candle starting to, starting to melt. This one's. 
Well, there's some wet stuff down the bottom. A bar of soap, hanging in there. Temperature in the shade is a brisk 110. And there's Daisy out here. Daisy. All right, I'm gonna let those go for a while. Oops, I left my thermometer out in the sun. Look what it says. Uh, that's funny. 140 degrees. Surprised I didn't ruin this thing. LP hasn't changed much except for it's warped a little bit more on this side. The real candle completely melted. Bar of soap is sitting in the wax. This one has buckled. It, it's very, so I can, look at that. I can. Watch this, hold on. I'm gonna put on my hot hands and destroy this thing. There you go. Oh, you know what's weird? It's not as it's it's not as flimsy as when I first put it out here. It's actually hardened again. Interesting. It was more flimsy earlier, but now it's actually harder again. So in the end, pocket hose brass bullet could not handle the hot sun here in Las Vegas, nor could Twisted Sister. But it was a good test. I'm glad it was suggested. I still think it would probably have lasted if I hadn't done that. But a lot of people do use it outside for more time than I had it out there. I'm still going to say the metal garden hoses have been outside quite a bit and they have not had the same kind of problems. Pocket hose brass bullet failed the heat test and I can't give you any more updates on it because now it's destroyed. I appreciate you watching. Please subscribe for more as seen on TV product reviews from me, James White, Freaking Reviews.